So, Gypsy Boy and Gypsy Boy on the Run. These are biographies written by Mickey. He grew up in a Romana, Romany Gypsy home. He grew up travelling the UK in a caravan and very old fashioned traditional Romany world. Roma, Romany. I'm not sure how to pronounce that. Roma, I'll say. I'm reviewing them as one because really they are one book. Uh, Gypsy Boy on the Run picks up directly where Gypsy Boy left off. So they could be one book really easily. Um, the first book is his first 15 years of life and realising that he's gay. And realising that he wanted, he had to leave the world he grew up in. There's some really vivid depictions of abuse, be it phys both physical, mental and sexual in these books. Especially the first one. Um, so I do warn you there, it's not easy reading in some parts, but it's beautifully written. It's what I call, I apologise, the light, the, this is my lighting called. It's what I like to call an easy read. It's the kind of book you can pick up and put down, but you get engrossed in very easily. Um, book two, Gypsy Boy on the Run, picks up there and his adult life and going out into the world and what happened to the, his father and his mother and his other relatives. And it's, it has a really positive, happy ending, which I liked. It left you wanting more, and I hope one day he writes more books, because I'm a big fan of this guy as a columnist. And his YouTube channel is hilarious. Um, I'd love him to write more books one day, be it fiction, be it, be it another biography. I'd, I'd be very good about that. Um, they're heartbreaking places, both of them. I mean, ex relation. This book goes more into relationships, be them dysfunctional, be them functional. I, I think his mother sounds fabulous. Um, his sister also sounds fabulous. Um, but they're they're what I like to call a heartbreaking, thought provoking biography, which which is unusual because I've said this in another video that we live in an age with these ghost written celebrity biogs that are all very much the same and these are definitely not these left a mark with me that has stayed with me for a very long time um these are a definite recommend for anyone who wants to read something that's a little bit outside of the norm both of the books i'd recommend reading them back to back that's how i read them Gypsy Boy, then Gypsy Boy on the Run, the because that's, to me, they're one book. They feel like one book. Um, I genuinely think that these, these are up there in my top ten biographies of all time. Because they are just beautifully done, brilliantly written, intelligent, funny, sad, thought-provoking, touching in many levels. Um... I would say, don't expect the cast of My Big Fat Gypsy Wedding. They're Irish travellers. There is a uh, Irish gypsies. There is a difference. There is a big difference. This world he comes from was far more conservative. Far, far, far more conservative than that world. So yeah, pick these up. I know America has a different set of covers, but do pick these up. They are phenomenal rates.